Welcome to today's episode on Tech Ascend. If you missed the last episode on how to become a certified project manager, click this link to watch it now. In today's episode, we delve into the fascinating world of SEO, search engine optimization. If you've ever wondered how websites rank on Google or why some articles pop up first when you search for something, then you're in the right place. Today, we'll cover what SEO is, why it is important, where you can study it for free, and how to study it effectively and potential career path after mastering SEO. Before I dive into today's tech skill, let me ask you this. What are your thoughts on a person having multiple hard or soft skills? Is it right or wrong to develop multiple skills, especially in a country where having just one job might not be enough to cover all your bills? Drop your answers in the comment section below. Let's get started. So what exactly is SEO? SEO stands for Search Engine Optimization. It's the practice of optimizing your website and content to rank higher in search engine results pages. This involves various strategies and techniques to improve visibility, attract organic traffic, and ultimately drive more conversions. SEO covers everything from keyword research and content creation to link building and technical optimizations. Now, why is SEO important? Here are a few reasons. SEO helps your website appear in relevant search results, driving more organic traffic. Websites that rank higher are often perceived as more credible and trustworthy. SEO involves improving the overall user experience on your site, which can lead to higher engagement and conversions. Unlike paid advertising, SEO focuses on organic results, making it a cost-effective long-term strategy. Understanding SEO can give you a significant advantage over competitors who do not optimize their websites. If you are interested in learning SEO, I have great news for you. You can study it for free online. Here are some top resources. Google's SEO Starter Guide, a comprehensive guide directly from the search engine giant. It's a great place to start. Moz offers an in-depth, easy to understand guide that covers all the basics. Arifs provides a free course that includes video tutorials and actionable tips. Yoast, known for its SEO plugin, also offers valuable insights and tutorials on its blog. HubSpot offers free courses on SEO covering various aspects of inbound marketing. Now, studying SEO effectively requires a structured approach. First, begin with introductory courses to understand fundamental concepts. Create your own website or blog to apply what you learn. Experiment with different SEO techniques. SEO is constantly evolving. Follow repeatable SEO blogs and forums like Search Engine Journal, Semrush Blog, and the Google Webmaster Central Blog. Familiarize yourself with tools like Google Analytics, Google Search Console, Arifs, Moz, and SEMrush. These tools are essential for analyzing and improving your SEO efforts. Engage with SEO communities on Reddit, LinkedIn, and specialized forums to ask questions, share knowledge, and stay updated on the latest trends. Once you've mastered SEO, there are numerous career opportunities available. You can become an SEO specialist by focusing on optimizing websites to improve their search engine rankings. You can create and optimize content to attract and engage audience. 
oversee and integrate SEO strategies within broader digital marketing campaigns. You can become an SEO consultant by providing expert advice and strategies to businesses looking to improve their online presence. Here you can offer SEO services to various clients enjoying the flexibility of freelance work. SEO skills are in high demand and businesses across all industries need experts to help them navigate the digital landscape. Whether you aim to work for a company, agency or start your own consulting business, the opportunities are vast and rewarding. Get to know why I chose this topic after project management? Well, I got myself an SEO beginner certificate and also an advanced SEO certification almost a month ago from Simply Learn. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you. I have a few other skills such as this one and I'm constantly exploring new knowledge. Let this be a reminder that you can pursue those dream courses by utilizing the free resources available on the internet. That wraps up our episode on SEO. I hope you found this information valuable and are inspired to dive into the world of SEO. Remember, the internet is full of free resources and with dedication and practice, you can become an SEO expert. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon so you don't miss any future tips. Thanks for tuning in and until next time, stay productive and don't forget to give love always and no hate. Happy optimizing.